Hi, welcome to Gloomy Hearts Montessori. So today I'm going to be talking about what Montessori education is all about. But before I go on, I'll briefly talk about the woman who developed this educational approach. Her name is Dr. Maria Montessori. Dr. Maria Montessori was born in Italy in 1870. She was a physician, an innovator, and she was regarded as one of the most accomplished educators of her time. So what do we mean by Montessori education? Montessori education is a child-centered educational approach, not a teacher-centered educational approach. It's unlike what we get to see in most of our conventional schools where the teachers will stay in front of the classroom and will teach whilst the children will listen and watch and at times learn from the textbook and also where the teachers would um, assert control over the materials that would be used, when the materials would be used, how and where and also will also determine the pace at which the children will learn. So this is a total departure from that. It's aimed at helping the growing child to fully maximize our potentials by providing age-related Montessori materials to help that child to grow physically, cognitively, emotionally, socially, and to help the child to develop effective verbal communication skills. In the Montessori school, there is what is called the prepared environment. The prepared environment is a well-lit, very beautiful and attractive classroom. Everything there is child size, ranging from the chairs, the shelves, the tables, and in fact the Montessori materials. And the primary purpose of the prepared environment is to render the growing child independent of the adult. So the child does not need to depend on the adult for her freedom. And in the Montessori school, the teacher is a vital link between the prepared environment and the child. So once the child comes into the prepared environment, the teacher introduces age-related activities or exercises to the child. And once she observes that the child has a basic understanding of how to use these materials, she's then left alone and given the freedom to choose her work. Naturally, the child will gravitate towards exercises or activities that meet her needs. And as the child begins to work, we see certain skills being developed and refined. Skills like concentration, independence, fine and gross motor skills, self-esteem, self-confidence are all boosted. And these are skills that are needed for success in life. The Montessori approach uses specially designed concrete materials that represent abstract concepts. So exercises start from simple and naturally progress to complex. Here, the child is not just mindlessly reciting or chanting things or information that she does not know anything about, no. The tools of learning, that is the Montessori materials, are in our hands to explore and to manipulate. And so learning for the child is very easy and fun. In the Montessori educational approach, we have a multi-age setting. Here we have children of different ages all in the same class learning or learning different things. For example, in the early childhood classroom, we have children between the ages of two and a half and sometimes three to six all in the same classroom for learning different things. We see some working with their peers, others working in groups, and some working all alone. The Montessori educational approach understands the uniqueness of each child. So that's why learning experiences are personalized so that each child will work and learn according to their pace. In the multi-age setting, we see the older children teaching the younger ones and thereby consolidating and strengthening their skills and knowledge. And also we see the younger children watching and observing what the older ones are doing and are also inspired. So when the time is right for them to learn that exercise or activity, we see that it's not entirely new to them. So that's what the Montessori education is all about. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, share and comment below. 
So see you all in my next video. Bye.